welcome back. This is Bella Scoop with an episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 3. I'm joined, as always, by my trusty squad of Abel, Nova, Gloon, and Sackman. When we last left off, we were climbing the Crystal Tower. It is time to keep going. We need to head to the other side. Over, yeah. What, what do you want me to say? The, the place is not designed for treasure hunters. It is designed to prevent treasure hunters. I have to go back and forth constantly. We fought you before. Let's keep going this way. We need to head left here. Get some more treasure down here. We get the white musk, which is awesome. I see a door there. That looks like it's going to be the way up, so let's go down here first. And over here we get the Fuma Garb, which we've gotten before. And I believe Abel still has equipped. No. Can anybody else equip? No. No. Okay. So it goes on Abel. You know, up by two. Could help in the long run. Could definitely help in the long run. Doesn't look like there's any more treasure this way. Do we have at least a new enemy for me to show off? Isn't this a... Uh yeah, I don't know. I don't remember if we saw Doge's clan before, so I will put this in. Uh, let's go for Thundaga because I've got a shit ton of those, and uh, we'll go for Aroga just in case. Just in case. Looks like we got a critical hit for 7,500 damage. Come on, go with Thundaga for another 2150. Abel comes in. He gets 6,000 damage in. Will Aroga be enough to finish him off? Is he classified as flying? I think he is. Break up. Miss, miss, miss. Damn it. Damn you to hell. He stoned my Sackman. 5,000 gil. 5,333 experience. A job of love for Abel. And that's it. Hold on while I get my Sackman back. Okay, let's keep going this time. Let's go up the way that we're supposed to. Hopefully I won't get stoned going this way. Here we find a door. Hey, what? And the way has been open has been open for us. Awesome, we get Oh, because of Unai's key, it worked. We're almost there. Everyone, be strong! Yes, we will be strong as we continue on. Uh, we don't have much of a choice in this room. We're just going to go this way. Awesome. Do we have any new enemies to show off, though? We do. Who is this? Garland? Platinol. Okay, we'll take it. We'll, we'll take on Platinol. Why not? Uh, let's go for another time. Daga. You can go for Aroga again, and you can attack. Hopefully, this will be enough to finish him off. I'm not getting the heals as I used to, so, uh, you know, I'm trying to be a little bit more cautious about these spells that I'm using, but I don't have much of a choice in the long term. I, I do need to, to use these spells in order to finish off these enemies. Otherwise, it's just going to be bad news city for everybody. 2200 damage. Oh, shit. Oh, double shit. Okay. Uh, can you use... You, you cannot use the Elder Staff. Awesome. Can you use any... How many potions do I have? I bet I have a shit ton of potions. Where are they? How much equipment do I have on me? Good lord. I only have 13 potions. What the hell happened? Okay, use a, a high potion on yourself. You use the Elder Staff. You can only use it on one person at a time, which kind of sucks, so I'm going to use that on Abel, and hopefully uh, those healing items go off before he dies? No, of course not. He dies, and no healing gets done, of course. That is the way it always must be. 7,600 gil, 3,300 experience, a job level up for Sackman. And we can keep going, I guess. Going to risk not healing, but that's going to be, should be fine, hopefully. Is this the way I need to go to get treasure? I swear I saw a treasure chest up here. And here we find uh, shinobis. Two of them. Let's quake their ass. Naroga their ass. And attack their ass. Uh, these should be reskins of what we saw before. I don't think they are any stronger. But just in case. Oh, that's right. I forgot to heal. 
Damn it. Down goes one, though, and the other one already got his turn in, so this shouldn't be too bad. How much damage does Quake do? Not nearly as much as I would like. Aeroga does come in, though, and does not do nearly as much as I would like, once again. Ugh. Just attack. Then you need to cure Aga, everybody, and then you can attack. And then hopefully... Well, it looks like... No, it does not go down. Well, okay, now Sackman's coming in. That should definitely finish off the Shinobi. No need to heal. Down it goes. For the two Shinobi fight, though, we get... 7,400 gil, 4,400 experience. Awesome. Do need to heal for sure this time. Now, I saw, swore I saw a treasure chest up here. I did here. We get an elixir, which is always worth it. Always worth it, but it's kind of a walk. Still worth it, I swear. Elixirs are awesome. I have not used one yet, uh, but I plan on using a lot this dungeon since it's going to be so long. I've been saving my elixirs forever. I'm gonna go right first. Down these stairs to find a winding path. Come on, give me something. New enemy? No. Actually, I did miss a treasure chest up there, so I do need to go back. Uh, I, I thought I needed to go up. Apparently down is also a way I need to go. But if we take this way over to the left, I think up. Up and to the left, there it is. We find another elixir. Now we do need to go the way that I originally got. Yeah, I thought the treasure was down there. I was wrong. So let's head back down these stairs here and then over to the left like we were going before. Eventually. Now we can go to the left the way that I had originally gone. Just trying to go through this thing too fast. That's my problem right now. We need to go this way instead. And here, we need to go... Yet. Yes, we need to go right. I had forgotten for a second. <laughs> I hate forgetting. Uh, we need to go over here to the right. But I remember there was something special about this floor. That's because there's a secret passage. Uh, I couldn't remember if it was left or right. But it is on the right side, this secret passage. And you need to find that secret passage. Otherwise, you can't go further along in the tower. Yes. There are secret passages in this game that are required in order to finish the main quest. How then is it supposed to be, like, I don't know. You shouldn't have mandatory secrets. That's just me. But over here we got a phoenix down and another fight. With a new enemy. What do we have this time? We have a Glacia Labolas. And I don't like the looks of it one bit. Uh, let's go for Bio. Might as well go for non elemental this time. Go for Aroga. Go for a regular attack. Go, Aroga! Yeah, it does it does a good amount of damage. I'm yeah, it's it's decent. It's decent, I should say. He does a decent amount right back though, doesn't he? Good lord. Come on, Bio! Finish the job! 1989. Oh, it looks like he's poisoned. I believe that is Sackman that, that's doing the poison. Uh, we'll do another Bio. Uh, another Aerobe, even though I'm starting to run low on those. Uh, you go ahead and attack. Should finish him sometime this round. Go, Aeroga! Enough for the win? No! Sacrin must come in once again! Down he goes. I, I'm not even going to try to remember his name and pronounce it wrong again. We get 8,400 gil, 3,450 experience, job level up for Abel, and that is all. But like I said, there's a secret passage over here. It's always hard to tell if you're moving further along in the secret passage, but looks like I did make it all the way through, and this gives me a shuriken. Hold on. Okay, doing good on time. We can go up these stairs here, and 
find stairs that lead down. Yes, this is another secret passage that is required if you want to continue through the tower for some reason, I believe. Pretty sure. Pretty sure this is required to, to go through. This is always the way I've gone because it's the way to get the most treasure. Up here we get a phoenix down. Always good. And then, sir, oh, there's a secret passage here. I might be thinking of another one. No. And here we've got two gum gums. Nope, was thinking of a different part of the dungeon. If we go over here, we get an elixir, which is always nice. We need to head over to the right this way. And here we can find a treasure chest all by itself. In this treasure chest, we get an elixir. Always, always good. And then we can head over to the top of the circle and continue on through the dungeon. Uh, nothing in here, so we can just keep going. Nothing around the sides or anything. And then we need to go to the right and through the secret passage once again. And more secret passages that are necessary. Not a fan of that, to be honest with you. Just not a fan. Let's keep going through all this. Or just to the bottom. Now we can continue the winding, the winding path. Through here, we need to not go that way because that is a dead end. Here we can go up into the next area after this fight. Let's continue up then. We go into the next area. Here we have two choices. I choose left first. I also choose a fight first. Against a new enemy. We have the Dark General here. Let's go ahead and use our magics on him. Yeah, just a rogue. Regular attack should be fine. I do need to heal a little bit eventually. Probably after this turn, unless... He happens to kill one of my one of my mages, but I don't think he I don't think he can do that this time. No, unless he gets a critical. No. Okay. We're good. We're good. We'll definitely need to heal though. That is definitely on the ball for what I need to do next. Go Aroga! Blow him away! That did quite a bit of damage actually. Let's go for another bio. You can go for a Kiraga on everybody, and then you can go for an attack. We should be getting cl yeah. I was about to say we should be getting close to him dying, which is always a nice place for us to be. For that fight, we get 8,600 gil, 3,450 experience, a level up for Abel, level up for Novin, and I believe that puts everybody at level 55. Now, yes, it does. But I do need to heal. Be right back keep going and all this way over here we get a treasure chest better be awesome phoenix down not nearly as awesome as i was hoping but i will take it i'll take it let's try to go over to the right this time after fighting these new enemies here we have thors really that is what we're going with we're going with thors oh holy only targets one Bullshit. Tornado. Everybody. There we go. Why is Holy only able to target one? That's bullcrap. Actually, probably should have still gone for the... No, these guys are still alive. Holy crap. Should have spread it out a little bit better than I did. Go, Tornado. Blow these guys away. It missed. Are you kidding me? Still for bio. Regular arrow. You can attack. Should finish this guy off pretty soon. After Abel's turn, I think, we should be able to finish this guy off. Down he goes. Down go the Thors, apparently. For that battle, though, we get 8,000 gil, 4,800 experience, a job level up for Novin, job level up for Bloon, nothing for Abel or Sackman. Too bad, too bad. We're gonna keep going. Try to go this way a bit. Let's keep going over to the right here. I know the video is probably gonna go a little long, but I do have a stopping point in mind. 
But first, we have to fight this fucking green dragon, who I hate like you wouldn't believe, and you guys haven't even seen why yet. I'm gonna go for holy on this bitch. Fucking green dragon. Die. I hope you die. Ugh. Oh shit. I did a lot of damage. Mabel cannot take two of those. It missed. He's on the ground. I know he's flying, but he's on the fucking ground. Go, holy! Really? We're calling down meteors on your ass. No, seriously, you need to die. Don't let him get his turn in. Don't let him get his turn in. He must die. Oh, shit. Alright, it's spread out. It's spread out. It might not kill everybody. Might not kill anybody. Don't don't hit Abel. Don't hit Abel. Okay, sweet. We all lived. Go, Aroga. Show him who's boss. That is not what I had in mind. Go, Meteor. 3,000 more damage and he still lives. He still fucking lives. Let's go, Flare. And... Kiraga, everybody, attack again. We need to finish this guy off. Come on, we cannot let the green dragon win. We have come far, too far, far too far, apparently. We lost our sacrament again. Luckily, Bloon is alive and able to heal everybody, except for sacrament. Go, Flare! We will finish off this green dragon. Or we won't. Holy crap, this is just a random encounter, damn it. <sighs> Raise. This isn't even a boss fight. This this is random. Good lord, does it do a lot of damage. Come on, Raise. Bring me back my sacrament. Come on, Flair, finish the job! Seriously? Seriously? I don't know what to do now. This green dragon. He might destroy me. Oh, critical hit for max damage! Still not enough for the win! No, how much, how much health do these guys have? This is not good. This is not good at all. Well, that's gonna help a little bit. Alright. Can you use Arise on everybody or is that gonna be overpowered? Okay, let's put it on Sackman for now. 7,000. Still. Still. This is getting ridiculous now. How is this guy not dead? I just have to hope that he doesn't go for Abel again. I know that's that's wishful thinking, but I mean we're getting so much damage in. I mean this guy's got more damn more health than any boss that we've fought thus far. Down he finally goes! Novin's still a little weary about that battle. We get 13,330 gil, 15,000 experience, a job of up for Sackman, and an elixir. And even though I didn't want to, that is definitely going to end this part. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. I've been Bella Scuba. I've been joined, as always, by my nearly dead squad of Abel, Novin, Boone, and Sackman. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.